Okay, so it's going to be number one. Students in this classroom work hard, Which some in convenience stores, restaurants, okay. driving for Uber. Here, they're working to learn skills to elevate their professional lives. It opens doors for people. It, it opened doors for me. 23-year-old Fernando Buenrostro Velasco is a recent graduate of a free tech support job program run by Masir, a nonprofit based in East Boston. So we set up computers, we image them manually. Um, we would also connect to the printers the basics, you know, just to get our foot in the door. The eight-week program teaches software, how to set up and use programs, but also hardware, how to actually build and connect computers. Very proud of me. Well, I work as a global technical service manager for a medical device company, and this is something that I do to give back to the community. It's brand new computers. From Rashid Mokabir started the program when the COVID pandemic made it obvious people need this type of training. There was like a lot of people risking their lives for minimum wages. Community IT professionals got together and we said that we need to do something about it. Absolutely. These are your donations. Computers coming. both used and new donated by another Boston nonprofit. Tech Goes Home, make it possible. Uh, we've been around since about 2000. Um, so we've been in schools, community centers, through different nonprofits we've partnered with, like Masir, in an effort to really try to ensure that Every individual who is out there that's looking to be connected has access to be connected. Tech Goes Home has given out roughly 40,000 computers and tablets since the start. It also offers internet access and basic computer training. Masir takes it a step further. We give them internship opportunities and help them get a certification, help them build their resumes. One of the internships involves rehabbing old Tech Goes Home computers and creating computer rooms for those in need. On this day, Masir students are getting a local senior center set up. Or right after. Fernando was no working as a baker you know, at it, Star it be Market busy, before so and during his time at Masir. Yeah, so you worked nights and then came, came to school here. here, basically. Yeah, and then I would also work the weekend, so no, no downtime. Amazing, but look, it paid off. Oh, it paid off. I, I was like, oh, well, if I have to do this, you know, if I want a future. That future is at Emerson College in the IT department. I just image computers really or help teachers out. You know, I set up the computers for them. I love it. It's so much fun. That is a full time job that Fernando started this January. His just one of so many incredible success stories at Masir. Find out more about both Masir and Tech Goes Home on WCVB.com. Erica Tarantel, WCVB News Center 5. Closing in on 720 at night.